joined in the coach's corner now with head coach of uh, the women's volleyball program, Dave Trumbo. And coach, you guys went on the road down to Lynchburg, um, pick up two wins uh, over the weekend to continue that win streak you guys got going. Could you talk a little bit about um, the team's performance down there? Uh, yeah, Joe, we went down to Lynchburg. We actually played on Friday night, played two matches on Friday and two matches on Sunday. So we actually picked up four, picked up four wins. So it was a great weekend for us. Um, we were able to play everyone when we were down there, and the competition was still good. Um, so a lot of the freshmen got a lot more time, opened some real eyes this weekend. Uh, Katie Leffridge hitting four and five hundred from the outside uh, as a freshman, and then Emily Castro was able to set uh, for five sets, and <laughs> she was pretty amazing too. So a lot of depth, got a lot of good court time, and we were able to win th win all four. So that was great. And then you guys come back for uh, your game tomorrow evening versus. Uh Crosstown rival, if you can call it, McDaniel. Mm -hmm. uh, talk a little bit about um, that matchup for you guys. Uh, McDaniel's a big one for us. Just because they're right up the street, you know, we love we love playing McDaniel. And you know, when I got into this, McDaniel used to kill us, and then it got close, and then we used to beat them good, and now they're back. McDaniel's back up, so I'm expecting a really competitive match uh, with McDaniel. We know them well. We played them in the spring, and uh, they've got a they've got a nice group of players there. But we got them in our home gyms, and last when we played Frostburg at home. Electric. I mean, the whole men's ice hockey team was there, so that was really fun. We had a really nice crowd, and this week it'll be hopefully as big a crowd, and it'll be even a more competitive match. Absolutely, you know, we love having those crowds there. Mm -hmm. It just keeps the uh, the momentum going for the girls. On Absolutely. The court. Um, now you guys head away uh, on Friday and Saturday for that same setup that you guys had last weekend, playing four games over two days. Mm -hmm. uh, could you talk a little bit about uh, those matchups you guys got coming up? Well, just like this weekend was one of those weekends where, to tell you the truth, I would have been disappointed had we won all four. Uh, this weekend we're going to be tested. We're going to play Carnegie Mellon, who beat the number eight team in the country. I think they beat Juniata, who's number two, and then lost to someone. I mean, so makes a long story short, Carnegie Mellon's really good. Quality teams <laughs> yeah, they, we went five with them last year, and we're not able to win. Uh, then we followed that with Ithaca. Ithaca's getting votes in the top 25. Uh, then the next day, we play arch rival Salisbury, the other SU. Right. <laughs> right. Yeah. yeah, the other SU, uh, which is always a great match. Last year, we played them twice, and we split. We won, we won a match, and they won a match. And then the last match is Ohio Northern, also getting votes in the top 25. So <laughs> we have our hands full, but it's the only way we get better. It's the only way we get better and learn about ourselves. Uh, and I thought that was key in our victory against Messiah last week. Now, Coach, on uh, last Wednesday, you guys played Messiah at Messiah um, in a huge monumental and momentous win for you guys um, heading into that weekend that you had last weekend. We have been pointing towards this match, Joe, since the end of last season. We knew we were going to get them the first week, purposely playing Christopher Newport, Boston UMass, teams like that to prepare us to play Messiah. We talked about that last week. We went up to Messiah, over 1,000 people, standing room only. Messiah is always very respectful. I mean, they a loud crowd, but very respectful, and it was a phenomenal match. Uh, we were able to come out with a 3-1 to one victory, uh, which – really sets our season up as far as now we want to get better. We want to add to our resume. If we would happen to get an NCAA bid, beating teams like we talked about this weekend, if we can get a win against Carnegie Mellon or Ithaca and, and teams like that, that will help to build our resume to give us a good seed in the NCAA tournament. Thank you for your time, Coach. He's Dave Trumbo. I'm Joe Wamba, and this has been the Coach's Corner.